Hi right, guys, welcome back. Uh, back up on the Salt Lakes. We're on uh, top pond, first pond. We're on the one where you first come in. Uh, I don't know how this turned up, maybe eight or nine. Yeah, that wind's cold, but yeah. We come out last week, so it was froze solid, and I'm, I'm not breaking no ice. No chance. There's no chance of that, man. Green grow. But yeah, so fishing. Sunday open. I'm on peg six. I'm on peg six. We're drawing peg six. Up Sunday open. Like I say. Um, Got a, a feeder chuck to Ireland, but I've just first cast with a ten of one cast. But my first cast, first cast were even worse. To be honest, it went straight up in trail, fishing for squirrels. But never mind, we've all done it, haven't we, I suppose. Yeah, so first cast went up in tree. Um oh, we're in. Into a fish already. Um, so we're in, yeah, we're in already. Just in, I just turned around then from that fucker, I tipped the slack. God, the water's dropped so clear, it's unreal. Big deck, big Four pound of fun, man. So there we go, first one of the day. That's crazy how clear that water is. Need to push my net out a bit. Yeah, well, I didn't expect that with two, with literally two minutes in. That's four pounds for it. Just casting off at Ireland the bar. Couple of foot off. Not gonna go all the way up to Ireland yet. It's never been done. Yeah, Marge is quite deep here. So yeah, three minutes in, four pound isn't it? Oh, shit, Kevin. I just got to spill two nuts today. Big the buzz, isn't it? Wait, it's a bit too cold, off. Like I said, I've uh, got. I've only got two lines set up here. I'm still having to plug the other one up. Always running behind me on everything. So yeah, just going to put my short line up, but yeah. Um, it's a good start, I like that from here. But definitely didn't expect that. Definitely didn't expect that at all. Um, well, uh, a line out to my left. Got so a bit of ground bait and a bit of pinky. About 11 metre. Well, yeah, 11 metre, sorry. I line out to my right, same distance, um, for soft belly and expander. And I'm just going to do this one for the, the short line. Um, at the bottom of here, just for a bit of meat, a bit of a visual, so you can get a couple of pieces of meat down there and see if we can get a boot. Because even though it's been cold, I have still caught a few on me in the past few weeks I've been coming. Sometimes I think them last couple of fish definitely help me win, win a match or at least come somewhere in the match, you know what I mean? 
I'm not gonna lie, I'm not gonna lie, I'm not gonna lie, I'm not gonna lie, I'm always, always winning back. No, no, this, this one here. It's uh, big, does anything? <coughs> oh, to be honest, I want to fish just as the slope starts coming up. Okay. Because there's no wind really on this side of it. Um, so I'll just push them back shot down. Oh. Need it to be at length. See, that's why it, it seems to be the, the bottom of the flattest. Not the same perfect, even though that's perfect. Now. So I'm surprised how shallow that is here. It's nice there actually. Nice fish up there. A bit of an overhanging tree here, let's see. To the left. A bit of an overhanging tree. It was, it was deep here, sticking. The uh, sticking so much to make bed. Well, it's not enough to go into the river. It's that big, definitely. I'm fishing it, it's mine. Last thing I want to do is begin bigger, bigger, bigger. Well, I've got these big tied up. A bit of the line. That time, I'm going to leave that big one and fish it here. I'm going to fish it just like that. I think the shade, we've been so clear, the, the, uh, the bit of a snag being there might be a bit, a bit better. Just straight out in front, we've been so clear. Can't we've done it. I mean, it's just dropped out of it at the end. But yeah, that's where we're at right now. So we've got one fish in, a 10 minutes bang on, 10 minutes in. And um, yeah, absolutely buzzing. So anything happens from now and to end of March, I'll keep it updated. But until then, guys, I'll catch you in a bit. A little quick look at the bait tray, some dead pinkies. Some meat, two different types of micros, 
bit of ground bait. Had them skin bobs just to come along for some bait sprays. So hopefully that'll be it. That's all we'll need. That's all we've got. Oh, there we are, guys. So yeah, we uh, an hour in. We've got three F ones and a small carp. Um, so I've had two on tip, a carp and an F1. I've had two on pole off to my right. Um, just tapping my crows and fishing a, a two miller on hook. That's what I'm doing at the minute. So a few at a time, five or six pellets at a time. That's all we're doing. So, like I say, I think we're on about, I would say about £15. I think I've had five, five fish actually, sorry. Having to dot the float down to virtually so there's nothing there. Just the tip, like the, the last millimetre or two of showing. Just barely see it float. <laughs> it's ridiculous. Well, that's how I want it. That's how delicate the bites are. So... That's how it's going to have to be. Indication then on float, I had an indication then. So, so far, so good. Can't see what anyone else is really catching, to be honest, to my left. I'm on MPEG number six, peg six. But we'll see. Might have to alternate lines, catch a couple off this one, move to the other one, catch a couple, let them settle back down. I'll try for a few more minutes on this line. Oh, that wind. That wind's picking up now. I wouldn't do, wouldn't it? Thing would do. If it picks up any more, I'll have to change flow. Because I want to put a point for. Mm. That chop's making it hard to see it float now with being dotted down so small. That was an indication though. Mm. 
Red and black to ace the hand, baby. Get another few minutes on this line and I'm going to move to my other line. That would about. I'm going to get a rest. I'm going to rest in a minute. Move off this line in a sec. I'm going to the other one. I know them little skimmers were there. I could just tell with the indications all day and them little skimmers had moved in. And we'll rest that line for a bit now because them little skimmers have moved there. Right? I don't want to catch them. I don't want to catch them. I don't want to catch them. Not on that line anyway, so... That to me tells me there's too much bait there. So I'm going to come off that line now for a bit and try this other line. Last thing I want to do, be doing is catching. I want to keep that as a soft pellet line for, for a reason to catch skimmers on, uh, F1s on. Out of control and taking it to. Oh, so yeah, I'm going to try this line now. Bit of ground bait, ain't cool. I was trying to fish two lines at the same length at pole. Just can't see point of the... Well, that pull through nice. Oh, that float cell, it's a, oh, it's a chanty type float so it's a, a fibre tip so they're more, they find them a little bit more sensitive than, well they are more sensitive than hollow tips. You can leave a bit more bristle showing. Mm -hmm. I think a shot might have pinged off this rig. I hope that's a bite. Try that again. So I do think there's a shot in the. I don't know if a fish were holding that up then or what. But yeah, so that's where we're at. We've got a couple of F1s, four or five, um, and a few skimmers now. But yeah, I'll give you an update as and when if else happens or changes. I've got a couple on. Well, there's seven of one now up, Paul. Bit of a bad net in that line.
badminton, bad, bad, badminton. But I am so like that, so you can see it. Nice brush. It's another three pound at net. Need to add another shot on this roll. Need to add a little bit more shot. Yeah, so we're doing all right, actually. We're doing all right, but yeah. So about six F ones in there now in the car. So we're catching a bit. Have a couple. On. We're having seven of one now up pole. Bit of a bad net in that by me. Bad net in, bad, bad, bad net. But hey, I'm just a light lash, so you can see it. Nice brush. It's another three pound at net. Need to add another shot on this roll. Need to add a little bit more shot. But yeah, so we're doing all right, actually. We're doing all right, but yeah, so there's about six F1s in there now in the car. So we're we'll catching a bit. Hi guys, welcome back. So, um, just drop back up to a little bit. Just not in line a little bit. I've had a few F1s, we've got about seven or eight F1s and a, a few skimmers and all of you. I think I've got about 20 pounds. It's about 20, 20 pounds, I think I've got this one. Um, just grab a drink now, so I put food in my car. We've had mostly about some power on, on the, the ground bait and pinky, pinky line. We're going to have a few bites on that. Um, Day skimmers and then get an odd F1 and then I'll do it in between. So yeah, it's been all right. I've drawn a good peg. I've drawn, well, not always a good peg, but I have drawn an MPEG, so. It's all right, I just peg. That chop over there, I think, I think he's, uh, about had enough and he's off and he's gone so he's doing that wing carrying everything but yeah he's doing alright so that yeah, it's 
that midway into March. We've got about 24 inch power in there. So, open. Open there. That would be good. Yes, I'll come back up to it. So, like I say, I've had a few uh, on, uh, on that line. Just feeding, I thinned off some ground bait right? with uh, flower sieve, get all the particles out. Yeah. Open. Oh, it's basically, only feed what's in there is my pinky, really. So, I took all the particles out of ground bait. Right? Can get you in a bit of a bad position. <laughs> yeah, so just trying to begin now. So. Another, another drink, come have another drink, and then go back to catching. The problem is the wind's picked up, so the float I've, I've picked to use for the day is not. Not the best, not the best option, um, to be honest with you. Could have done with a, a, a steel body fault instead of a carbon stem fault, just draw with it a bit so the wind start pushing down the spray. It's quite a deep area this, I didn't know how deep it was. Yes, it's quite a deep area. I only just realised, I only just found out how deep it actually is. There's a deep hole down here, in fact. Take five apparently. Can we get another few minutes on this to quit to Ireland this time? I think you could not block now in a few minutes. Yeah. I don't know if Sprinkling a few pinkies every now and again. Like I said, I've caught F1s now, the feet dry and fish it. So every line I've fished, the right line, I've caught a couple of F1s off that. The left hand pole line, I've caught a couple of F1s on that. And I've caught a couple of F1s on the pole, on the, on the feeder. So, we're happy with that. I'm not getting no indications up to it. It is that time of day where it's a bit funny. Where everything is a bit funny. Yeah. But yeah, other than that, I'm doing quite well. But I'm enjoying it, that's what matters, isn't it? It's not like it's mega pool money, few, few quid on pool money. But, um, have this drink and then we'll go back up for What I could be doing actually. Wow, that's it. That too didn't taste too. It 
came to the top of the race. Let's go. That's just how I... Sorry. <laughs> I can't see where that chat was going to, isn't it? I like that said, I want to see what is off that said. Is that the last match I, I the last time I fished this lake, I won the match off that said. Get a sprinkle cap on that one. Um, But yeah, so that's it for now. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna probably and leave you. Um, I'll come back to you if anything else happens. But hopefully, this new microphone picking everything up. Um, and I'll get back to you in a short while, and then I'm gonna go back up for next another week. So I'll jump and have another So I'll catch you in a bit, guys. Hi guys, so like. Um, a couple hours it's about half past one ish, something like that. Yeah, 20 past one. Um, we've got about 28 ish pound in it now. We've got on clicker. Um, hoping we we'll get a couple more. It has gone dead quiet. I'm gonna go back out on pole now and just chuck it back out on tip, see if I can get a pull on tip, but nothing at the minute. Um, so it is early, so I'm gonna. We'll go back onto that skimmer line and plug away catching some of them skimmers but yeah until then guys yeah i'll catch you in a bit hi guys welcome back yeah so yeah i'm back on pole now um, it's gone hard it's 20 past one um, and it's gone really hard i said we've had a good run this morning as you'd expect. I'm gonna go back out on pole. See if we can get one on pole. My try. Fishing a bit of an expand, one of the micro expanders on the top. Put that ground there. That's a good one. Such is all to leave matter on what that to me. You just need fish about, you just need to turn back on again, so you can quick stop at the moment. I might have put pink in, I'm coming back at it. A bit of a better stamp still on this side. It's nice, it's a nice day to be there. The wind is a bit of a pain, it's just staying on that. And it's time when I'm pulling my way. So many baits now, so I'll expand it. I'm just going to pick up and throw it in the oven. Just that thing. We're all pink fish. I know that brown bait's actually skinny. It's pretty good. Catch it. 
Stop the one in the face so far. I'm a cold in a minute. I'm gonna eat, eat the best. See what difference it makes, and then let's try two glasses. Put the peepers on. If that makes any difference. That wind's pushing across now. It's No, no, no. The only patients I've ever left. It's out of the context. It's close enough to get some of that. I'm sure that's inside down there. I don't understand why it's going on. Look at this stuff. That seems to have anchored. I'm quite surprised not having many of the patients at all.
they may sit there and I'll pull some ground bait and top some ground bait and they'll come back and I'll top it up. Try the right on my list. I just want to bite a tree, it's absolutely nothing, it costs 40 minutes and that, I don't know. Do you It's really strange that we're going under every two minutes. Another 60 seconds. I'm extremely dead, ladies and gentlemen. Mind up that. Sorry, I'm not going to feed anything.
Let's think. Let's think. So what I'll do, guys, is hopefully it'll start picking up a bit. If it does, I'll, uh, I'll give an update. If not, obviously it rains.